The monetary rule is an idea for how to avoid inflation. If the price level is equal to m over q times v, and if velocity is constant, then any change in price depends on a change in the ratio of m over q. Or to put it another way around, an increase in m over q in the long run will cause inflation, assuming the velocity stays constant. If m over q stays constant, a, a, a a stable ratio of m to q will mean stable prices. So, if that's true, if keeping m over q stable gives you stable price level, then what does this mean? to keep m over q stable? Well, it means that the central bank, and this is the rule, the rule itself is that the central bank, the Fed in the United States, keep the rate of growth of the money supply roughly equal to the long-term growth of real output, Q. Because if so, if the rate of growth of M is equal to the rate of growth of Q, approximately, then the rate of growth of P, inflation, will be roughly zero. And that, to a monetarist, is a very desirable goal. That's a wrap.